I guess. I guess we go in in the sub. Sploosh. Pretty certain we are closing in now on the end. Good, good. Um, Listen, Pat, captaining. Nice landing, but yeah. uh, <laughs> let's not make it a habit. What the? Hey, it's Sophia. I don't think it is. Something tells me she's not going to be looking like this. I thank you. My spirit and my body have lived apart for too long. Perhaps in death. Are we going to have to kill her? Reunite. In peace. I'll grant you my power before my spirit diminishes further. Stargazer will guide you, clever one. If you find my body, please help me. Oh no. Please. My guidance ends here. After images of memories rage on the seaside because of ergo, please be careful. This is a cool looking environment. I can't hold out forever, but I'll support you. About Simon. I am the daughter of Valentinus, leader of the alchemists. Simon was my father's right hand man. Hmm. Ambition overwhelmed him, however, and he spread the petrification disease, taking countless lives. Why would he do that? I don't know. Yeah, but he brings right. a dark world upon us. Is it to get That's more sure. ergo Stop. into the crowd or cord or whatever it is beneath the the land? What tool? The petrification disease freezes time and memory within the afflicted body. Ergo is the purified essence of that life, trapped by the petrification disease. When I discovered that. It opened my eyes, and I was able to manipulate time using Ergo. Mm -hmm. Simon, on the other hand, is... Yeah, so she's the reason for our constant resurrection. It's because we're not resurrecting, she's winding back time. ...time to protect you, so you could stand against him. So stop him. I wonder how many times she's done it. Yeah, because if you look at the description of this. The power of the watch turns back time to when the boy was in peak condition. Okay. So we've got invisible walls. Well, they're not exactly invisible, but we've got walls. And she says the beach is full of...
Beach is full of broken memories. What I'd like it to be full of. Ah, we're going to get some story. We're going to learn about Geppetto's son. So that was young Carlo, who became friends with Romeo, who ended up being the puppet king. So if the puppet king is trying to stop what's going on, is the Geppetto and Manus working together? So this is how the friends met. This place is oddly devoid of enemies. But I guess this is the calm before the revelatory storm. He didn't even come to your graduation. I don't care if an old man like that kicks the bucket. Don't say that. It's nice you got any family at all. Let's start talking about this. Oh, she's here. Grab her. She's here. Dim Ergo Crystal. Rank 1 Moonstone. Some pieces all over the place. But no enemies. Please teach me how to use a sword. You're a legendary stalker. Ugh, seven on. Gemini, get rid of them. I'm off. Sorry, my controller is, um, it's warm. <laughs> so I'm holding it in a weird fashion and occasionally swapping out to mouse and keyboard. Yes, this section is kind of mysterious. And the fact that there's no stargazer. Kind of odd. Oh, there's a red memory or something up there. I mean, we're going to have to fight. Probably does. Ah, I see enemies. There's our stargazer. My God. No. I'm sorry. I was too late. I, I 
wish I got here sooner. If I had known this would happen. You feel warmth. So something happened to Carlo. It was Geppetto's son. Geppetto lost his son and is trying to bring him back through us. All right, there's many a thing left to do at the hotel. And Sophia's no longer here. Time unknown. I assume we can level up at the Stargaze now. Yeah. I don't want to talk anymore. Yeah, we've uh, <laughs> pretty certain we've screwed up her quest line somehow. Not entirely sure. I think maybe. The thing is, we killed the guy as he was saying, please don't attack us. So it's possible that he might actually have had some dialogue for us. But obviously, we were so used to the NPCs not being attackable. Ooh. It's going gold. Huh. Uh, did we have any quartz? Have I come up here for nothing? Yeah. We did. I'm going to put another point into this. Uh... Perfect Guard Fable Charge. Auto Charge Legion. Alright. Did you know about Sophia? Apparently, I must remain. Be careful out there, won't you? Apparently, I'm... Be careful. Oh. She has no more dialogue. Right. Uh, uh, was it you with the box? No matter what fate serving her can... No. At the house of Vanini. Add shop goods. The Great ah, Vanini Collection. Vanini's collection, the House of Vanini, deals only in masterpieces and works of special genius, sir. Special and genius. To say that for you, the That's me. Is open. At the House of Vanini. Right. Durability grindstone temporarily avoids durability consumption. Temporarily activates perfect guard. When guarding. Anything new from you? I can hardly believe it. But the ergo readings you gathered leave no doubt. Uh -huh. No doubt at all, you see? I do not. Okay, Vanini, breathe. Despite your best efforts, they can't read your mind yet. <laughs> My friend. My apologies, but when you hear this news, you'll be excited too. Okay. The puppets were being compelled by the Grand Covenant, but they were communicating with each other, with wavelengths. This is beyond anything I'd imagined. They so were they were communicating. With this kind of intelligence. They've got more sentience. I did the best I could to decipher the wavelengths, but there was considerable noise in the signal. Care to give it a listen? Sure. Carlo, I hope you can hear me. The laws of the Grand Covenant bind us. We're his puppets. First law. All puppets.
Humans must obey their creator's commands. Law Zero. The creator's name is... Geppetto. Giuseppe Geppetto. Ah, did you hear that? The last part sounded important, but there was too much static. Ah, tell me you heard it, please. We need to find the cause of the frenzy, and this may be our best chance. What or who was behind the frenzy? Uh. Whoa. Really? Nothing. Ah, uh, I've tried everything. That was I weird. Think, but I keep coming. Anyway, I'm lying. All I wanted was to stop anyone else getting hurt. At least hurt by murderous puppets. Not even I can abolish all pain everywhere. Ah, no, you cannot give up Venini. You are Venini. And Venini always finds the solution. Uh -huh. I think we can't put it off any longer. Geppetto is the last hope we have. I've exhausted my talents here. These clues... I could find them, but interpreting them but is just, beyond just my confirm allegiance. what we suspected. We need the man himself. You must save him, Compagno. You and Geppetto are the only ones who can save Krat. Hmm. Right. Uh, do 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 do. Craft that. Collect all lesion arms. Fabulous. I got... always welcome. Decipher the cryptic vessel. Huh? When did we get that? Que bello! A brand new design. No, a whole new model. What a thrill! And there we are. Done. Even a brand new model doesn't stand a chance when you're dealing with... Did we get that from killing Aladoro? But the device bordered on genius itself. Required all my intellect. If you ever meet the creator, get me their calling card, won't you? No, oh, sorry, I'm sure you're busy. Just let me know if you ever find out. Dear beloved sister Eugenie, please forgive your brother for leaving without telling you anything. I'm keeping this letter even though I don't know when I'll be able to send it. I'm being chased because I know the biggest secret of crafts. I'll probably be able to see you if the alchemists are gone from this land. But I'll have to watch you from afar until that day. I plan to protect you until at least we can live here in peace. Just like how I saved you from the workshop tower. It would be wonderful if people learn the truth one day. Aladora was usually his brother. But some truths are better left unknown. Among the alchemists, I saw all too often how cruel humans can be. After seeing all the experiments and nightmares they were responsible for, I came to believe that there is no God. Instead of revealing myself and risking your life, I'll choose to vanish forever. Still, please remember me if you ever read this letter came from across the wide ocean i hope there is only truth in your life and leave your name here i know i know people here call you usually as their way but that name will protect you please remember your real name your name is the end of the passcode decipher is damaged so it is unrecognizable Huh. These boxes are not breakable. Right. Who else do we need to talk to? Oh. Benini again. You may not be aware, but uh, I am an orphan. I am aware. In fact, 
My parents were murdered before my very eyes. The authorities in Krat insisted it was a mugging, but I know mm -hmm. what I saw. A mad, raving puppet killed them. A puppet that was driven by a murderous lunatic's awakened ego. I know that because the lunatic told me his name. Arlecchino. I'll the never King of Riddles. Insane laugh. I have been fitting puppets with the Grand Covenant to ensure no one else ever has to experience the same tragedy I did. But this is our last shot. The last clue. Mm. So he is. Doesn't break through the statue He's a murderous puppet. And the but Trinity thing. To all this is Geppetto. He's really our only hope. And it's up to you to save him. Go on and take the wavelength decoder. Even if I failed, you might be able to find more clues. You're someone who doesn't give up. Who knows? If you need to hear it, just use the stargazer. Here, take it. King of Puppets message. King of Puppets black box deciphered by Vanini it can be heard better by using the decoder at his stargazer. Humans wish to talk to puppets, but they were limited without Ergo. Geppetto's puppet may be able to read the veiled messages. Okay. Killed him. I'm Romeo. Best friend. Huh. Black Seaside. Also, I heard Eugenie. a rumor from a recent arrival. Is Ali Doro truly dead? Uh, yes. I don't know what to think. I didn't get to repay him uh, yet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I did think it was strange. The more I saw of him, the more different he seemed from the person I knew. Uh -huh. I wonder what the real Ali Doro was like. Right? The fake one wouldn't dare hurt someone like him. It's a pity that I couldn't find out who saved me. I suppose that means he's out there in Krat, maybe saving others. If we tell her that my heart the real Aladora was her brother. Maybe it's because it's been so long since I heard about him. Thanks, anyway, for looking and for telling me. And now I'm giving it to you. You Even showed me, me the truth after all. And that's priceless. Far East Princess. Another record. We've got quite a few records now. I'd really like to just sit and listen to them all, but uh, they're quite long. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Still missing nine. What is happening with this? It looks like it's turning golden. It's 
definitely getting longer each time we lie. Or each time we feel warmth, maybe. All the records have been very nice. Nice pieces of music. Not always quite the sound that I expect. Oh! Hugo! Hold on, I'll talk to you after the record's finished. <laughs> you feel warm. Hey. Hi. I didn't think we'd meet again. How did you get I just here? Come back from the relic of Trismegistus. Trismegistus. And I had no idea it was connected to the hotel. I should add that to my map. <gasps> There's a phrase I use quite a lot. It was grim work out there. I found the real Aladoro. He's dead. Probably yes. Died heroic. One hundred percent heroic. I buried his body and collected his belongings. It's a tragedy. So the real Aladoro, who was Eugenie's brother, was killed by Parrot, the fake Aladoro, who was killed by me for being an like asshole said, about everything. I'm an explorer, not a fighter. So you would know. Is this weapon any good? If you're worthy. I'll give you Aladoro's weapon. Uh, don't seem to have any way of proving our worth. Belongings to someone who knows their worth. Hmm. Right. That I think is all of the cleanup. Done. 24 hours later. A new screen's changed again. Interesting. Hello, friends, and welcome back to Lies of P. Our hotel is a mess. Belle is still here. I don't want to talk anymore. Even though she shouldn't be. We are today almost certainly not going to finish the game because I suspect there's still a chunk left to do. But we're going to do a little bit more at least of the Black Seaside. I actually meant to start recording a good chunk earlier, but... I was editing together some of the footage and the let's just say I've had some issues today with things rendering properly. I've wasted a lot of time re-rendering two annoyingly long Ark Abbey entrance time unknown. Whoa! They have cannons. Um, yeah, the videos have gone wrong. And I've had to redo them. And it's kind of annoying. Oh, oh, oh my lord. Ah, it's the big guns from... Yeesh. Ooh. Oh, he's seen me. I have no intention of fighting him. Yet. Uh, nope, never mind. Ow. Wondering actually if the are the cannons doing any damage to them? Probably not. Oh, he's still a coming.
Oh shit, he's still a coming. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. So if we can get up there again, must destroy the cannons. I don't mind if the enemy that's firing the cannon respawns. It's the cannons itself, I think, that don't respawn. Or maybe it's both of them. I'm not sure. There's cannons on both sides as well. So. Strongly... Oh, there's a thing over here as well. And here. Ooh, those are low res. But again, that's how you get games optimized. You sacrifice textures in some places. Which is something that a lot of people on the internet don't seem to necessarily realize. I'm going to fall off this wall. No, oh, what am I? Uh -huh. There we go. Okay, your corpse. Oh, nah. Oh, I did die. Okay. One dead, at least. <laughs> I may need to speed this section up. I'm five minutes into the video. Five minutes into my first recording of the day. And already, I'm telling future me. And it's going to be a while before future me gets to this. Because I've literally only just got to the... As I said, the Puppet King. Right. Two cannons down. I think there was a third lot over there. You. On in range. Come here. So said Pistris to. Listen, my brothers and sisters. Uh, no, I, Adriana, recorded for the brothers and sisters. Praise Pistris, the one who will swallow even God. Listen, my brothers and sisters. I, Pistris, shall tell you about ancient secrets. A star that was curious about humans, pretended to be human, then became one. The humans saw its splendor and called it an angel. Although its form was the same, its substance was different. The undying substance, the breath of metal that lives forever. That is the reason humans wished for an angel. The angel gladly shared immortality with humans. But that blessing wasn't for everyone. Really? Yeah, there's, there's a definite feel of an underlying cosmic thing. No. No. Right. Done with. Okay. 
We are now free to approach this place however we want. Chances are that was a waste of time, but we'll see. Let us continue upwards. The Abbey. Uh, oh, good. Giant snake things. Is there one on this side as well? Yes, there is. And I like the the eye iconography. And proper proper insight vibes. What the? Oh, that was the backs uh, backstab animation. I must have somehow pulled one of those off. Um, definite feeling of this was like built by giants or something like that. It's a, a big old ed edifice. Oh, hi. So, he thinks probably a good job that we killed those guns because it looks like door guardian okay oh shock what was shock i forget Um, this is the same move set as as what? Um, ow! Dear Lord! This is the same Musa as the second. I've done no damage to him yet. Jesus Christ. Okay. That was, um, strong. Oh, it looks like the big scorpion boys do, in fact, stay dead. It's good to know. No? Why is it? Is it just regenerating health? Because he doesn't seem to be taking any damage whatsoever. What am I supposed to do? He's not taking any damage. Huh? I, I, what am I missing? It's got to be a gimmick boss, right? If it's not taking any damage. And they haven't really had any gimmick boxes. We've had gank bosses. But nothing gimmicky, really. I, I, I've got no healing. What the hell does shock do? Because it is... It's doing something. Whatever it is. Is it... Oh, it's probably stamina regen, isn't it? That's probably why I'm struggling with... Yeah, when in shock, your character's stamina recovery immediately decreases. What, what am I missing? <laughs> Jesus Christ, I can't deal enough damage to it. For... I don't get it. It's not staggering. It's not being stunned. I've not been able to set it on fire. Hitting it seems to bounce our blade off half the time. 
There's no cannons to turn on it. There's no harpoon to use. We don't have the amulet that we need to get through the door, so we can't surpass it that way. It probably drops from the guy. What? Okay, so we need... Right. He's got a belt that's targetable and a leg that's targetable. But his other leg, which weirdly you can't target, is in a brace. So, is this like a fire giant situation where you focus on his gammy leg and break it off and... You know. But yeah, you, you can't target that second leg. Uh. Oh no, he's got shit on the back of that one. Hold on, have we just... I mean, we've still got to get close enough to... Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about his health i think we need to shit we need to shit yes i think we need to break his leg Because damage is far too low for this to be the way this boss fight is supposed to be done. Oh, no. Ah, there we go. Oh. Aha! There we go. Right, now he's going to go ape, of course. I'm hoping to be able to dodge through that, but I cannot. No. I know that you can't technically dodge those attacks. No, oh, feck off.
Go on, let the fire finish him off. Yes. Okay, so that that's our gimmick boss. And we got a high level. An unlocking device obtained after defeating a high level alchemist. It opens the mysterious door in the Ark Abbey. The Ark Abbey was built for a covert, covert and lofty purpose. Wake up, evolve, ascend. This was the alchemist's ardent wish. Ooh. You used high level alchemist badge. Ah. A handy handy stargazer. Oh, my hands are now moist already. Um blah, 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 blah. I think we'll probably Oh, I should have um tried out the new grinder, shouldn't I? The one that gives us perfect good That's me looking around for what the sound was. Okay. Uh. Oh. Okay. I'm stuck in the corner here, so. Okay, I was expecting him just to murder me, but... Oops. Oh. Oh! Should have thought about that, shouldn't I? I've forgotten to go get my souls, haven't I? Oh, it's not 16k anymore because we lost a load from taking damage. I forgot that was a mechanic. I'd completely forgotten that that was actually a mechanic that we uh, that we lose souls from taking damage right we don't need to go up there again so I'm gonna heal oh interesting The uh, soundtrack is very sweeping, isn't it? Uh... I'm... No, I don't think that's a path. Oh. I don't know what that stuff is that they spit. It doesn't actually seem to give us a status effect, but it's gross. Oh, shit, hi. Those guys are actually really weak. Yeah. 
Oh. Okay, so we're going down the side. Merchant repair tool, yes. Oh, hello. There's another way we can go, but very clearly. We need to, to deal with this guy first. There's a guy behind me there, I think. Oh no, it was an item. I saw the blue. Okay, that's further up. Not worried about further up just yet. Oh, hello! Not entirely sure where you came from. Right, we've stopped the cannon. Ah, I spy your shortcut ladder. Oh, in fact, I saw this shortcut ladder. Didn't do anything about it previously. Well, couldn't, obviously. Because that's how games work. Yes, this is a very... Very dramatic sound, isn't it? Yes, I feel like a chunk of the souls we lost were probably from the... The door guardian. Uh... Wasn't there an enemy patrolling here? Oh good, another one of them. Two of them, in fact. And a chest. Okay. I mean, if I can get... One at a time? One at a time, that's all right. It'd be better if I hadn't done that, but... Ow. That's a weird attack. Uh, oh. <laughs> Did you see me preparing for the, the tail swipe that never came? I don't see any more cannons up there. Veterans amulets. Oh, you have noticed me. And... Uh, well, I, I pressed the heal button then, but it was having none of it. Increases max legion. Meh. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. Legion has proven very useful for me. Wake up, evolve, ascend. Greet the god who will soon resurrect from the top of the abbey.
Ow, that was the tail swipe that I looked out for before. Now, while I really like the fire effect, I actually find it obfuscates the enemy model a little bit and makes it a little bit trickier to tell what the enemy is actually going to do. I'm not entirely sure why I rolled there. <gasps> Gasp! As if anybody saw this massive ladder and thought, oh yeah, we're just going to be able to go through that door instead. <laughs> hmm. I've now got enough ergo to level. Ah. And handily. The stargazer has which to do it. Level up. Um, I I think we've gone well past the soft cap, you know, of Legion. Because we're getting just as much attack. We could go for no. I feel like an, I feel like we should have enough stamina. We should. Oh, Cobwebby Castle. Classic. Ooh, hold on. We're 56 minutes in. That's going to do it for this particular episode. There's a shortcut ladder back. So we are climbing the Abbey. What was this stargazer called? So we've gone from the Black Seaside to the Abbey entrance, where we fought our door boss, literally. And now we're up at the outer wall. So it sounds very much like this is a, a fortress rather than an abbey, which we're going to fight our way through. We shall penetrate the outer wall, hopefully, next time. Hopefully you'll join me for that. Until then, stay safe, stay fabulous. Have a great day. Cheerio! Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, why not click the like button and consider subscribing. Remember, you can ring the bell notification icon to get notified when new videos go live. And until next time, cheerio.